In addition to performance simulation, Arena uh, offers the ability to create cost simulation. Okay, so let's, con let's consider the following example. We have a post office and a small post office. Create process another process and dispose. In this example we're gonna consider in this example we're gonna consider okay uh, arena cost simulation okay okay so arena cost simulation <coughs> Arena cost simulation. Okay, the cost of each resource would be defined in the spreadsheet. Okay, and we're gonna calculate the following total cost, which is equal total busy cost per hour, which means how much you're willing to pay a resource per hour if he's doing the job, if he's busy on the job, and if he's idle, which means he is, <coughs> excuse me, he's working, but he has nothing to do. So he's uh, during his working hours, during the normal shift of the day, but he has no work to do, which which meant by idle time. Okay, so total idle cost per hour, as long as how much, in case we want to pay him, cost per job okay per unit okay so and we're gonna ring them so post office system in post one every minute or every two minutes so this one is known as <coughs> billing process this delay release resource name is okay, bill person the person who collects the bills and so it's gonna be on average which mean expo which like if we say for example two minute expo two minutes which mean one letter every two minutes and that person will be the mail room okay this is delay release okay the mail person and as well as we're gonna consider on average so C is delay release it's like four minutes and post office system out okay so this is send to back and gonna highlight them name the view add f flowchart close okay so now we go to the resource so basic process resource okay so we have fixed capacity the whole day one which means the person is always working at his capacity we never use more than one unless the person become like superman he could be like twice three times four times faster his speed so busy per hour here is 7.5 idle per hour 7.5 which is the same cost and we're gonna pay him like two cents per hour and here is 7.5 7.5 you can choose any currency you want and this way we're working by per dollars okay so and we here we defined the person is paid 7.5 cents per hour and the mailer is paid 5 7.5 we could make this value as 5.15 and this value as 5.15 per hour regardless if the person is on job or not if he's busy or idle and i have to repeat if he's busy or idle during the normal working hours of the day when he's available 
like he's sitting down and he's willing to do the job so he's busy he's in fact is working his others there's no work to do so he's sitting waiting for the job to come to him and this way we decided for both of them to pay them the same amount for the billing person and for the male person to pay him the same amount regardless if he's busy or not okay so let's see <coughs> how our result look like so if you come here and we're gonna duplicate the box okay so we just select the one here and we're gonna zoom in name the view add our results close results okay so we come here we say expression build expression uh, basic process resource cost total user so cost total idle cost total busy cost so we want all three of them so total busy cost resource busy cost bill person okay so we say okay and and uh, this is the format transparent background no border and done so this is the first one okay so and we're gonna duplicate this is a billing billing step operator total cost is equal to total cost is equal to control enter to go into a new line total cost equal to busy plus idle plus cost per job as simple as that so this is the first one so this is for the billing step operator we're gonna duplicate this for the mail room operator mailing room operator the same applies so we have the same value here and this is duplicate busy total busy cost and okay and we're gonna duplicate so this one will be idle cost and we're gonna say build expression resource cost total idle cost and duplicate as well as build expression resource cost total users cost and total users cost which is cost per job okay we're done in order to make this as uh, tidy we do the dialog design right click dialog design so we select select all three and we move them here and then we select all those three and just we need to activate this okay let's leave this for a second and so we do this and done so we have all three of them and if I need to the whole cost I need to duplicate this okay as the last which is be total cost This will be summation of all the values. So build expression, resource, cost, total users cost, plus total idle cost, plus total busy cost. Okay, okay, and done. And same applies duplicate. And we're going to apply the same value for 
okay the mail person build expression resource cost total busy cost mail person and the same for build expression resource cost total idle cost mail person okay and the same for the users build expression resource cost total users cost mail person okay I think I've done one mistake with this one so this one is busy this one is idle and this one is users while this one is summation all of everything just gonna gonna delete this so it will be total cost total users here is a mail person okay total idle the mail person and plus total busy cost the mail person I think we've done use idle busy so this is use idle and busy okay save we saved it okay and we're gonna run the program over eight hours run setup and before I forgot you have to enable the costing so it be project parameters and costing here you title the project then your name as an analysis and you describe the projects even if you leave it for a while and come back to it you find all the information here okay so apply okay and save so if we just run setup run the speed replication parameters we have to eight hours and if you run it very quickly Here, because you define all the reasons you have.